Hi guys, welcome back sa YouTube channel ko. So for today, ang i-discuss natin is isang sample problem lang for our math enthusiasts, yung mga math wizards natin dyan. So, yung mga back to basic lectures natin, tuloy natin sa mga susunod na araw. Pero for this time, sagutan muna natin yung isang problem na may nagtanong lang sa atin mga lods. So ito yung problem. If A and B are the roots of x squared minus 12x minus 8 is equal to 0, find the value of A to the 4th over 16 plus 120B. So, pinakauna kasing natin naiisip dito mga Lodi is we will try to solve for the roots of this quadratic equation. So, the roots of the quadratic equation can be obtained by using the fact. Pwede factoring, pero pinakaginag, uh, completing the square, quadratic formula, tapos yung mga extracting the root. Pero normally, ang pinakaginagamit kasi natin for general quadratic equation, that's quadratic formula. Kapag ginampit mo yung roots nito mga Lodi, kung hindi ako nagkakamali, ang lalabas dito ay, wait lang, uh, 6 plus or minus 2 square root of 11. But the problem is, isa-substitute mo ba yung 6 plus 2 square root of 11 dito, tapos i-raise mo sa to the fourth power? So, ayan, ang ituturo ni Sir IJ today, is paano natin siya i-manipulate algebraically. Gagamitin natin yung tinuro ko nung back to basic lectures natin, na tinatawag natin Vieta's formula or yung sum and product of the roots. So, di ba? Given tayo ng quadratic formula or ng quadratic equation na x squared minus 12x minus 8 is equal to 0, ang sum ng roots niyan will be, so ang roots natin ay a and b, so that is a plus b, that is 12. Kasi di ba ang sum natin is negative ba? Ang product is ka, negative ba ka? Negative b over a, c over a. Negative ng negative 12, that's positive 12. Tapos over 1, that is 12. Tapos ang product natin will be equal to, negative 8. Magdaan natin yun mga lods. Nilagay lang muna ni Sir IJ. Next, since mapapansin natin, dito na magsisimula yung algebraic manipulation natin. Mapapansin natin na meron tayong a to the fourth. So, ang pwede natin gawin dito, so ang mangyari dyan mga lods, that is x squared equals 12x plus 8. So, ang ginawa ni Sir IJ, in-isolate niya muna x squared. Yun yung tinira natin sa left side. And then, the 12x plus 8 napunta na sa right side. Kasi negative 12x will be positive 12x, applying addition property of equality, as well as negative 8. Since to the fourth power yan, ang gagawin ni Sir IJ, i-square niya both sides, para maging to the fourth power yan. Okay, so square natin to, that is x to the fourth, equals 144x squared, so square of binomial, 12 times 8, that is 96 times 2, that is 192x plus 8. 64. So, yan na yung magiging value ng x to the fourth natin, mga Lodi. Kasi ang x naman din is a root. I mean, yung a natin is a root. So, it follows na yung a to the fourth natin will be ganyan din, mga Lodi. 144x squared or gawin natin 144a squared plus 192a plus 64. Pwede yan. Parehas lang naman yan. Since a will satisfy this quadratic and b will satisfy this quadratic equation. So, meron na tayong una natin equation. I mean, another equation bukod dito sa mga sum. Eh, di ba may, tina, may nakalagay dito na B? Kaya, may A ka dito, may B ka dito, mga Lodi. So, kailangan isang variable lang. So, paano natin gagawin yan? So, from these two equations na nagawa natin, kapag ito yung ginamit natin, mga Lodi, may hirapan tayo. Bakit, Sir IJ? Kasi yung B natin, gagawin natin siyang negative 8 over A. So, magiging complicated yung equation natin kasi magiging divisor siya. So, ang gagamitin natin ito, so magiging b is equal to 12 minus a. So, anong gagawin natin dyan, Sir IJ? A to the fourth, ilagay natin to mga Lodi, 144a squared plus 192a plus um, 64 all over 16 plus 120b. Ulitin natin, ito yung r to the fourth natin, a to the fourth yan mga Lodi, di ba? So that is a to the fourth, I mean x to the fourth, so that is a to the fourth na. Sinabstitute natin yan mga Lodi, ito, dito over 16, plus 120, tas times b, ano yung b natin? 12 minus a. Simplify natin, 144 over 16, that is 9, a squared, plus 192 over 16, that is 12a, plus 4, Plus, multiply natin 1,440 minus 120A. So, anong lalabas dyan, Sir IJ? So, what will, be, what will it become is 9A squared plus 
12a minus 128, so that is minus uh, 12 times minus 120, that is 108a plus 1,444. Kaya lang, Sir IG, may 9a squared pa tayo, may a squared pa tayo, tsaka a. So, itong a squared, manggagaling yan dito, mga lodi. Yung x kasi pwede mong palitan ng a. So, ito, substitute mo dito. So, what will happen, that is 9 multiplied by 12a plus 8 minus 108a plus 1444. Anong lalabas dyan, Sir IJ? 108a, distributive property, plus 72 minus 108a plus 1444. So, makakancel yung 108a. Uy, amazing. Kasi natira na lang constant kapag inad natin, the correct answer is 1516. So, this solution is for our math enthusiast. Paano kapag sa engineering, pwede mo namang isolve agad. Makukuha mong value ng A is 6 plus or minus 2 square root of 11. So, pwede itong positive, i-assign mo kay A. Yung B, i-assign mo kay yung minus. So, magiging kapag sa engineering solution yan, sa Cal Caltech lang yan actually, 6 plus 2 square root of 11 uh, raised to the fourth over 16 plus 120 times 6 minus 2 square root of 11. Pero pwede na rin naman siya mag-interchange. And still, you will get 1516. So just in case you have questions or concerns mga lods, huwag kayo may magtanong sa channel natin, mag-comment. And ayun, thank you so much sa patuloy na pag-support and sa pag-subscribe sa channel natin. And more match tutorials to come. See you in my next match tutorial video and bye for now. Bye-bye!